to the General's Painting Corner. I am your host, the General, and in this episode we are looking at Space Moon Heroes Series 3, Death Guard. Uh, I'm super stoked, I've, I've managed to get all six unique uh, Death Guard sculpts from Space Marine Heroes Collector Series 3 and I'm, I think I've got another set on the way as well as I want to have um, a set with the actual heads uh, there are two, so you've got an option of having either helmets or heads and this uh, set I've given them all the helmets basically and the next set I want to give them all the uh, their actual faces which would be pretty cool so without further ado, let's get stuck in and have some close-ups of these fantastic Death Guard sculpts. Right, this is the icon of despair, the, the Death Guard Space Marine of the icon of despair standard, which anyone within six inches subtracts minus one to leadership. Um, I really like the sculpt. I like the little nerglings and little demons popping out from the base little kind of like tentacle demons with their mouths popping out from the base um we've got tentacles coming out from his armor as well he's got a plague sword he also has a plasma pistol it looks like over here which is pretty cool um oh it's a brilliant sculpt um i'm getting another set of these so i'm gonna have two icons to spare in two separate units and i'm gonna complete more of my seven man death guard units so i'm very very tough lovely sculpt um for death guard and you know this is a unique set death guard space marine piece that you can't get with the exception of the um, space Marine hero zero three um as i said i'm, I'm going to collect another set so i can just change the heads so i can have two units basically um so let's move on to the next death guard space marine Okay, so here is the Chaos Space Marine Death Guard Lord, basically, with the plasma pistol and also a plague sword. Um, you could also make him the leader of just a normal Death Guard Space Marine unit, doesn't have to be your Lord. A really nice sculpt, again, um, just like it. I like the helmet. Okay, again, you get these little nurglings on each one, which you put on the base, which is fantastic. Um, and again this is a unique sculpt we've got a bespoke design on this one of the shoulder pads basically which i think is pretty cool um and again very impressive for uh, a push fit model uh which uh, you can just put together now i glue mine together uh, one thing to watch out about these miniatures is the head uh, make sure uh, you, the heads or helmets make sure you put them um, you glue a, you glue the head to one part of the body first and then glue it in a common mistake would be putting the body together and then the head it won't fit because the head has basically um, a plug basically which you plug it in which fits in the head so you can move it around if you want you don't have to but just beware you've got to glue the head on one part of the body the bodies are always two parts they come in two parts where you put together or you can glue together and um yeah again another decent model uh, with a lot of intricate designs basically you've got the symbol of nurgle there um and i'm pretty chuffed i can't wait to use him and paint him put up together so let's move on to the next death guard space marine all right here's one of my favorite um miniatures in the space marine hero series three death guard space marines this is a death guard space marine with a fail of corruption which is pretty awesome um well as with all play weapons you can reroll wounds of one um instead of rolling to hit uh, rolling to hit you make d3 hit rolls for each attack with this weapon instead of one which is pretty sick this is something i'll give like maybe the plague champion because you get two attacks so that's two d3 hits um Exit damage from this weapon is not lost. Instead, keep allocating damage to another model. That's just huge. Um, it's plus two strength, uh, minus two AP, and it does two damage. That is pretty sick, to be fair. Um, yep, yeah, absolutely love the uh, pose. Um, can't wait to get another version of him, just with the different head. Um, again, what I do love is you get these little nurglings, which you get to put on on the base just gives it that bit more of a character but a great pose um, 
Also, you have a plague sword or a butcher's. I, I think that's maybe a a, a a it's either a plague sword or a plague knife or a great plague cleaver. I think it's actually a, a plague sword, basically. So he has that option as well. But yeah, looks awesome. Um, I would run with two of these in a unit of seven or a unit of five. Put it in the rhino. Have kind of like you know that beat stick infantry assaulting death guard unit would be kind of funny to be honest um going in and just holding up a unit because the thing is they can take the hits with the disgusting risley and you know, the toughness five three up armor save you know they 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 do they, they are kind of not, not not easy not not that easy to kill but again a lot of fun can't wait to use this and can't wait to have this uh, miniature tabletop painted and i just love the pose so let's move on to the next death guard space marine all right in the series three of space marine heroes you also get a death guard space marine with a plague spear now here's a real sick combo basically um that i'm going to try is when i have my two wow well, my second set is you can have two of him so i have him and the other one with a different head i'll also have two of him basically which would be pretty awesome um and then i'll have a, a a champion with a plague sword so i guess i'll make him my champion so he will be my champion which would be pretty cool and then out of my unit of seven i'll have the icon of the spare but here's where it gets sick so uh, my four of my models is two of these so i've got two flamers two uh, kind of like heavy flamers plague spewers basically which have a range of nine strength five minus one ap and then i'll have two of these guys so see, i'm getting a little bit excited now um for, for my combat charging and uh you have uh, the, the leader and maybe the other ones that i'm going to show next and you can do that that's the cool thing with the um play guard you can actually they, they, they are able to have a lot of uh, little special weapons in their unit compared to um, other space marine or chaos space marine infantry units which has got me really excited so again let's kind of give this a twirl it looks absolutely gruesome proper play marine again another little nurgling that you can stick in there which is fantastic and there you go um what i will do is probably uh, customize the head a bit for his next head and move his head facing the other way with his actual face uh, so i can have two in my unit um, i think that'd be absolutely brutal and gruesome so let's look at the next one all right so here's your standard death guard plague marine with a bolt gun and um Again, you've got this little Nurgling hanging on to his horns over here, which I think is absolutely fantastic. You've got Nurgling on his base as well. And just a detail of these new plastic kits, which are push fit kits. Um, I tend to glue mine, as I said before, are absolutely stellar. Very, very, very impressed. And now we go to the Death Guard Space Marine with the grenades yeah he looks absolutely awesome the plague marine the grenades and he's got you know one hand he's got the grenade and the other one he's just basically charged it you know taken off the taken off the pin to throw a grenade which is pretty cool and again nice little nurgling at the bottom there bolt gun attached as well great dynamic pose and he's about to throw some grenades and cause some damage which i love so you could easily use it as a blight grenade or crack grenades basically so again great sculpt um a very dynamic pose and um that basically covers all the um death guard space for me some hero series three let's have a look at them again as a squad all right so here they are as a squad again again great unit great collector series i mean if you're a collector as well and you want to have a bespoke death guard unit you know this is this will be right up your street um the only thing i would love to have seen is seen a seventh um 
death guard to make the unit full unit of seven i believe when this is released in north america and in europe they will have that seventh character this is currently released in japan right now and you've just got the six but if i follow precedence is that you will usually have an extra character don't quote me on this because i could be absolutely wrong and i believe in canada when they released the space for heroes 2 there was a different variant of one of the terminators as well so you can get possibly seven unique sculpts and we'll just have to wait and see when games workshop release the blind purchase version in the usa and in europe but yeah fantastic sculpts fantastic units i can't wait my actual squad will be two of these sorry two of those um the champion with a plague sword the uh death, a death guard marine with an icon of despair and possibly uh, one of either of these two to complete my unit of seven. And the way I'll do that is I'll just swap their heads because I do get these gruesome faces as well that you can choose as opposed to having the uh, actual uh, helmets on. And yeah, it's it's the new versions of very... I like, I like the art direction of New Death Guard. You can see some of them are a bit obese. They, they, very, they very much remind me of the tentacle horror Japanese anime kind of art direction, which is my preference. If I'm going to have something in my cabinet, I'd rather have something a bit more colorful than the um, old versions, which were really cool, but they were just really gritty and really, really dark and um, very Event Horizon-like. And as a horror fan, I've got no issue with that. It's just, I just don't want that to be in my cabinet. I, I like to have a bit more color and, uh, you know, it, slightly bit more cartoony is great, I think, because it allows, it, it gives a broader appeal to a lot more people to collect Death Guard as well. Um, so thumbs up from me. Really like the Space Marine Heroes Death Guard, Death Guard set. Very excited for getting my next set. And you will see me with my Death Guard army at some point in the future running, and you will probably definitely see this squad in, its, in a different variation and format being played on the tabletop so i'm very excited well that's me the general um, thank you for watching and uh, i'll see you in some other episodes